Hello and welcome. If you think that VLC looks a little bland, you can easily change the skin by going to Preferences and in Use Custom Skin there is a little link you can press which opens a website where you can download skins. But these are old skins. Some are very nice. For example, the Elkar one is kind of cool. So let's download this one. We're going to click it and press the download button and we're just going to pick where to download to and we can open the folder to which it downloaded here. So here's a file we could use for this skin. But there are much better places to find skins, in my opinion. Specifically, there is the DeviantArt VLC Media Player category. The link is in the description, you can find a lot of cool stuff here. I picked some out. We're gonna try out this skin. I'm just gonna press the download button here. Uh, sure, allow. We're gonna try this extremely minimal skin. There we go. And this one, the classic Winamp. Press download. There we are. So now we have this VLT file and these zip files. We're just going to copy this path and in VLC in the preferences, which is over here in tools, preferences again, we can pick use custom skin and press choose. Here we can paste the folder, path and press enter. And we're going to start with Elkar and save and nothing changes yet. You have to restart VLC. So I'll close it and open it up again. First time it's going to take a little longer. And there we go. You can resize the thing. And of course you can use full screen with F or double click. But let's try the other ones out as well. Here's the preferences button. Let's choose again. And let's go with minimal. Gonna have to restart again. All right, now here we have a problem. VLC apparently crashes when we do that. So what we're going to do is we're going to just rename the zip file of the skin to fix it. And VLC will fall back to its default non-standard skin. So we're just going to press Control P. And here we can choose a different skin. Let's try the Skyfire one. And restart. Okay, my mistake. Actually, we have to extract this one because it contains a VLT file. Cannot use this zip directly. So let's just gonna extract this. All right. And uh, the Skyfire one, same thing. Just extract all. There we go. And because it still keeps trying to open this zip when opening up, we're just gonna rename this and then it will fall back to its default non-standard skin. Okay, so now we're gonna try minimal, save, close, restart. And here it is, pretty cool looking, white minimal, quite bulky, but as usual we can just full screen and not very reactive regarding the uh, timeline. And as usual we can just press F or double click to full screen. That's it for this skin. Let's try the next, control P, gonna select the Skyfire one, save and close. Okay, this one we drag by the bottom and it looks quite minimal. And there we go. This minimal skin is kind of working. This one seems to be quite buggy though, it snaps. That's a bit weird. Finally, let's try the Winamp one. This one we can select the zip off and just save. And there we go. That's how it plays. Hope this was useful, give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment what kind of skin you like best, let me know in the comments if you have any problems with skins, and I will see you next time. Until then, ciao!